So rarely do I do this type of video here on the channel. My goodness, the last time we did something like this was over four months ago. <laughs> so normally here on the channel, when we go over brawler concepts or update ideas thought up by the Brawl Stars community, we get a bunch of them. But from time to time, we hone in on one thing specifically, if it is impactful enough or something that really captivates me, which is exactly what is happening here in this video today. One of the absolute best brawler concepts that I've seen from someone inside the community in a very long time. So we're starting things off here in today's video, taking a look at this individual's Twitter page. He goes by Rafa here. He is a very, very talented Brazilian 2D artist that has been doing a ton of work recently in the Brawl Stars community. And as you can see, he doesn't have that much crazy social presence or anything like that. This is the type of stuff I live for when it comes to these brother concepts or update idea videos. There are so many individuals in this community that work tirelessly, that are insanely talented putting out these amazing ideas, pushing Brawl Stars ahead in a very, very big way. Us already knowing that the Brawl Stars dev team takes the community's ideas into account on a lot of different occasions. So of course it makes me incredibly happy and I urge you guys, if you enjoy this guy's artwork or his talents and what he's doing for the community, be sure to check him out with the links in the description down below. So this new brawler concept begins with this tweet here coming out some time ago, and this is my absolute favorite format whenever it comes to releasing a conceptual brawler, and that is building it up almost like a brawl talk in a sense. This guy made his own thumbnail for this character's arrival and announcement to the public. Now the cool thing on top of this is he is outsourcing some of the work here for the new brawler concept as well with this individual here, another insanely talented individual in the community. I'm telling you guys, these guys are working so dang hard. You get that follow back, of course. But after this initial sneak peek, five days later, he dropped the brother concept. Taking a look at the post and the announcement of Greg here. Meet Greg. Greg is a member of Star Hunters. He is responsible for capturing aliens with his backpack where he carries his best friend, Zub. Just take a look at how insane Greg looks just visually here before we even get into the move sets, the amount of work that this took had to have been insane. And I applaud that hard effort, that's for dang sure. I adore this character, he's so dang cute. But it looks like he would be bringing his own trio to the game, the Star Hunters. Super, super interesting. As we move along, we can take a look at the concept art made by Rafa, looking amazing. Take a look at that backpack, the cute little alien chilling back there with his ability, I think, pertaining to the super after a quick read already of the move set here for Greg. But still, looking phenomenal. The collaboration with the end product of the 3D model looks so, so dang good. Taking a look at the profile, look how cool he looks. His hair is so big. I think he went intentionally making him super unkempt, huge hair, which we can see in the pins here shortly as well. But other things such as sprays as well as the profile icon, I believe that would be associated with Greg here. He's so, so dang cute. But yeah, taking a look at the pins here for Greg on top of it, he has so much hair. It's adorable. His face looks so small. It's so awesome. But his default pin there, his smiling, the cry, the angry, the thumbs up. We have the clapping pin, the sweat pin. The heart pin is so freaking cute. A new heart actually in the game would be arriving with Greg. That would be amazing. And then the special pin with his alien buddy in his backpack making an appearance for that one as well. It's amazing. As you can see, deservedly, this post got quite a bit of traction here inside the Brawl Stars community from Rafa. So huge congratulations for the successful drop of this brother concept. It would be awesome if the Brawl Stars dev team would add a brother concept to the game. But getting back on track, let's get into what Greg does here. So as you guys can see, Greg is a chromatic brother, hybrid launcher, super, super interesting. Greg would have a grand total of 4,200 HP with a normal movement speed. But moving along to the attack, raw prey, Greg throws his net to trap enemies that explodes for 1,250 damage. Super cool, seeing 
that there is a three second duration there, it appears that this basic attack would be a durational one, one that would take a little bit to activate, kind of like a squeak in a sense, I would say, but you could come to expect with a trapping ability in the basic attack, star powers and gadgets are going to be really, really interesting just with this basic attack alone. But next up, moving along to the super here, goodbye Zoob, the alien Greg holds in his backpack escapes and attacks his enemies, dealing 2,000 damage. I'm assuming that this wouldn't be just like one initial explosion, right? I would love it if this super would be once you get your super, Zub pops out of the backpack and assists you, a spawnable in the game. It's been a really long time since we've gotten a character that has a spawner kind of similar to a Bruce in a sense, right? Nita's bear. But moving along to the cool intricate abilities with the gadgets as well as star powers, starting off with the very first gadget. Surprise throw. Greg throws a net at enemies and nearby enemies, leaving them trapped and paralyzed with a duration for that paralysis being three seconds. So in my head, the way that I'm envisioning this is it would almost be like a gene gadget where you have this radius. If you have enemies within that radius, you activate the gadget and those nets would go flying, trapping them. So if that were the case, the potential for this gadget would be immense. Can you imagine getting a full team stun with just the click of a button? That would be awesome dude such a cool gadget but moving along to the second gadget here terrified alien when using the zoob accessory it breaks greg's backpack faster so it sounds like this gadget would just allow him to open up his backpack the ability of his super with this gadget just speeding it up or it kind of sounds like a supercharge rate increase to a degree and if that were the case as we mentioned before if his super would be more like a spawner not just a straight up damage it would be really really good a solid gadget there to get to your spawnable even quicker but moving along next to the star power starting off with the very first one called hurry greg's net blast is now faster thus making your reload faster as well duration 1.5 seconds faster so this would overall just be a solid increase to his basic attack right a increase of reload speed just allows him to have a higher dps on top of all of his other mechanics that benefit from having faster reload speed but then the second star power stolen health and i love this one so much greg orders zoob to steal 620 hp from the enemy causing greg to regain his health how sick is that i've always been such a huge fan of life leeching abilities right from like edgar mortis i find them incredibly incredibly fun to utilize and can you imagine the potential with this star power wouldn't it be cool if for example zoob his alien buddy in his backpack was a spawnable you launch him out once he deals that 2000 damage he comes back to you gets that damage that he dealt and gives you that hp and just continues that process it sounds kind of broken but it's a really cool mechanic some sort of life leeching mechanic i guess we kind of have that with bruce and the star power that nita has but it's a really cool mechanic but that's it for the build itself there on greg and what he would do in game but taking a look at the other posts that accompanied this drop of the brawler concept look at this 3d artwork it's so incredible davi wow the individual that we brought up earlier on in this video so talented just look at this it looks so flushed out it literally looks like a brawler that the brawl stars dev team would release don't you all agree and then of course credits to the amazing people who worked on this brawler concept project here huge huge hats off to all of you guys that worked on it and then of course to wrap things up there are some more concepts stuff going on here that are always super super fun to take a look at taking a look at the net it appears that that would be associated with the basic attack super interesting we have the super backpack there and zoob his alien buddy that's so awesome and adorable dude this character through and through just i'm really really enjoying it the vibe is so dang good the mechanics sound fun and the character's design is super cute and would fit into brawl stars so dang well look i know we've been getting a ton of new families in the game especially ever since we were confirmed that lola is now a part of her own family essentially making two new families right but hey if greg was introduced into the game i would not bat an eye at a brand new family this character is so interesting and fun but yeah everyone that's just about all i got for you here in this episode today whenever stuff like this pops up in the community when you can just see a tremendous amount of effort behind it and planning and stuff like that 
I feel like it's deserving to be covered on different platforms, right? Driving more attention to these talented individuals that are doing so, so much for the Brawl Stars community. So once again, huge well done to Rafa and everyone else that worked on this project. It was a pleasure to look through. But yeah, everyone, hope you all enjoyed the video here today. Hope you all are enjoying the start of your weekend. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Keep having fun, Brawl Stars, and we'll see you all in the next one. Adios and take care.